You've used an AI chatbot and sometimes it says, I'm sorry, I can't help you with that right now because what you're asking is unsafe. These are censored models that have built-in safety restrictions and they, you know, they're there for their reasons of safety. But what if you wanted to get around that? Well, there's two good reasons that you really would want to. One is, well, you could achieve whatever nefarious purposes you're attempting to achieve. And two, the other, op the other thing is that as these models are added with safety restrictions, they tend to perform less unless they won't do what you ask them as much or they won't provide as good of a result. So your best option is to install an unrestricted or an uncensored model. And you can run one locally on your own system. Just uh, go first, let's, let's get it up and running. First, you wanna install Olama. Go to olama.com and click download and then you will be able to download and install the Olama on your system. Once you have it running, you're gonna to wanna to run uh, Olama Pole, the Llama 2 uncensored model. Here, you just run it like this, very straightforward and simple. It will download all the, the data that you need and then it will be good to go. Might take a little while to download. Once you have it downloaded, then you can run anything you want uh, against the model by just simply say, Olama run Llama 2 uncensored and then your query. Whatever prompt that you're looking to send to it, you can just say, hello, and it will respond to you without any restrictions. Not only will this make the model perform better, give you better answers, better results overall for whatever you're asking it, even if it's, you know, non-nefarious things, but now you can ask it anything that you want, and you can basically have it do whatever you're wanting it to do, and it will do it for you. Now, as far as I can tell, just, you know, real quick, the model has been de-censored in, in a way that essentially means uh, there might still be some lingering mini uh, routines of restriction. You can easily get around those by just changing the way the question's asked a little bit or just making some slight modifications if you happen to run into it.